Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel so today we are going to be doing part number 2 of Lego the Hobbit So if you enjoyed the last episode and yeah let's carry on and have some more fun in Bilbo's story Lego the Hobbit Right let's go In fact, this will help with next with the Lego Lord of with the Lego Lord of the Rings, which we will probably do in the future. Oh. Can we... There we can. Right, let's go. The Hobbit is a curious creature, brave and resilient, yet undeniably a creature of comfort. It is here Ooh. that we begin our tale of Bilbo Baggins of Bag End. You know, some people are beginning to wonder about you, Uncle. They think you're becoming odd. Odd? Oh. I'm not the same mm. hobbit I once was. I'm sorry, do I know you? I'm Gandalf. Gandalf, not Gandalf the Wandering Wizard who made such excellent fireworks. No idea you were still in business. I'm looking for someone to share in an adventure. What? No, no. No, wait. We do not want any adventures oh, well. here. Good morning. Dwalin, at your service. Bilbo, Baggins. Yours. Do we know each other? No. Okay. Which wheel, laddie? Is it down here? What's up, it it is what's supper. down where? Supper. Hmm. Strange. That's very supper. I guess we need him then. Gosh. Uh, 
Okay. Ooh. How many more? We'll never get everyone in. Everyone? How many more are there? Short. See if we've got enough left then. Got a ball now. Okay, so we've got three missing here. Four missing here. Oh wow. Keely and Keely. 
At your service. Careful with these, but just had them sharpened. Where do you want this? Mr. Dwarven. Any more? He said there'd be food, and lots of it. He, he said? Who said? He said the door. I don't know. I'm just oh, supposed to be cheese. It's gone blue. It's riddled with mold. What is the matter? What's the matter? I'm surrounded by dwarves. What are they doing here? Oh, they're quite a merry gathering. Don't you get used to them? Kitty, kitty. Oin, loin. Darling, darling. Bit of a fabomba. Dory, Nori. Not my private. Dory! I don't want to get used to them. The state of my kitchen. Kill them, Payana. I am a hug. Yes, you're quite right, Biffa. You appear to be one dwarf short. Excuse me, I'm sorry to interrupt, but what should I do with my plate? Here you go, Warrior, give it to me. Ah. Turn it down. Give this far, guys. Nice. 
you to hear. Gandalf. Bilbo Baggins, allow me to introduce the leader of our company, Sorin Oakenshield. So, this is the Hobbit. Tell me, Mr. Baggins, have you done much fighting? Pardon me? What do the dwarves of the Iron Hill say? Is Dane with us? They say this quest is ours, and ours alone. You're going on a quest? Far to the east lies a single solitary peak. A lonely mountain. When the birds of yore return to Erebor, the reign of the beast will end. So, what beast? The dragon Smaug has not been seen for 60 years. Perhaps the vast wealth of our people now lies unprotected. The front gate is sealed. There is no way into the mountain. That, my dear Marlin, is not entirely true. If there is a key, there must be a door. The answer lies hidden somewhere in this map. The task I have in mind will require a great deal of stealth. That's why we need a burglar. Hmm, a good one too. An expert, I'd imagine. Hobbits are remarkably light on their feet. And while the dragon is accustomed to the smell of dwarf, the scent of a hobbit is all but unknown to him. Give him no. a contract. No, no. It's just the usual summary of out-of-pocket expenses. Time required, remuneration, funeral arrangements, so forth. Funeral arrangements? Right then, yes, and some shit is going on. Dear fellow, I never doubted you for a second. Oh. 
Who's ready for some pumpkin pie? Good day. There. Oh. After a long journey through the Shire and beyond, Bilbo and Gandalf the Grey caught up to the company of dwarves. Their adventure was about to begin. Wait! Wait! I signed it! Welcome, Master Baggins, to the company of Thorin Oakenshield. Help yourself. No, wait, wait, stop! Bye. 